What's up? It's Curtis Edmond here with Into the Body. Um, it is raining today. It's a very rainy day, as you can see the rain on the windows. And they say, it never rains in Southern California. And they tell me, but it's raining here today. All right, let's get into it. Um, why God does not answer your prayers. I have my notebook here with some key notes that I'm going to touch. And where you're, so you're praying, you're praying, you're going to church, saying, God, please answer this prayer for me, God. I don't know what to do. I'm lost. I can't pay the rent. I can't do nothing. God, you need to help me. Help me, God. I don't have nothing. I can't do nothing. And you're wondering why God is not answering your prayers. And you're saying, I'm praying, I'm going to church. I'm doing what you're asking me to. But here's the problem. See, before God answers your prayer, you have to have faith. You have to have faith in God. Now you're praying, you're saying, I need this, I need this. But I can't, I can't, I can't do it. And God says, okay, you can't do it. I have faith in you. I have faith that you can't do it. That's right, you can't do it. I hear you. I hear you telling me you can't do it. I have faith that you can't do it. I believe that you can't do it. That's what God's saying. God is saying, I have faith that you cannot do it. I have faith that you don't believe in me. That you need that, but you can't. Because you have little faith in me and a lot of faith in doubt. You see, for God to answer your prayers, you have to have faith. I can do this, God. Thank you for giving me the strength to continue on on this journey. I know I'm late on my rent, but I know I will work harder at work. I will find a way. I will seek and I will find a way to pay my rent. I will seek and I will find a way to put food in my children's mouth. I have faith in you, God. I have faith that you will give me the courage and show me the action that I need to take in order to make these prayers come true. See, that's the problem. God is always listening. But how you speak to God is different. If you're telling God you can't, God will say, yes, you're right. You can't. Oh, ye of little faith. But plenty of faith in doubt, little of faith in me. Let your dreams and what you speak come into existence. You say you can't, I believe that you can't. I have faith that you can't. You say you can, I believe you can. I have faith that you can. If you want to know how this works, read the book of Job. It's in the Bible. Here's a man with everything you could ever wish for. And the devil says, well, you gave him everything he needs. Take that away and see if he still believes. So God takes away all of his sheep, all of his food, gives him all these crazy diseases, makes him sick. You know what Job says? Job says, God, I know there is a reason for this. I know I serve you. You are my God. And I know whatever it is you're doing is for a good purpose. Let me be a servant to you. Let me live through you. God, I love you. That's the kind of faith 
it takes. That's the kind of courage that even when you're down, you know God is with you. So when you got a little credit card debt and you're praying that you can get out of the credit card debt and you're stressed out and you're saying, I can't do this. I'm in too much debt. I'm stressed out. Life is tough. Well, remember Job. Job didn't say life was tough. Job lost everything. But he kept faith. He kept faith. He knew that things were going to turn around. He knew that his God was a good God. And his God always had the best intentions for him as long as he had faith. And God proved his point to the devil. The devil tried to knock him down. God said, nope. And when God proved the devil wrong, God gave Job back everything he had times two. Doubled everything he had. He was already the richest man. And he gave him double that. Because of his faith. So have faith. Don't just pray and complain. Because remember, once you say, I can't do this, God. God's going to say, you're right. But if you say you can do it, God is also going to say you're right. So remember that prayer without faith is meaningless. So work on your faith and have faith that things will turn out good and things will be in your favor. And God is looking out for you. And times may be hard, but they will get better as long as you have faith. Like subscribe, comment, share this video, keep faith in your prayers, have faith in yourself, because that's what God blesses, people who have faith in themselves and work through God's prayer. Have a good day, have a faithful day, and stay joyful.